Today is Employee Appreciation Day. Thanks to our local resident and business owner, Ron Swanson, to my right, right here. And this is the second year that he's been doing this, where he treats employees that are working today to amazing In-N-Out Burger. I'm Ron Swanson. I'm president and CEO of s and Hardware Company Incorporated here in town. And it's just kind of a way to celebrate and remember 9-11, but also do something for the employees of El Segundo because they really do really well for us here. Well, we're celebrating um, the city of El Segundo's employees and what they do for the city every day. We have 240 full-time employees and, and a couple hundred part-time employees who work really hard to make sure that we're safe, that we have an enjoyable place to live. And as a resident, I'm very thankful for that. And other residents, I think, should, should uh, take a moment, even if it's just to say thank you or smile at city employees as they see them around town. We wanted to do it somewhere around Veterans Day. I checked with In-N-Out and they said, well, 9-11's open. I checked with the city and I go, perfect. Last year we didn't have the ability to put tables and chairs inside the fire department, station one. This year we do because they were under construction last year. This way there's more camaraderie and a little surprise, we're going to do it again next year. I already got a contract. Hi, how are you? Thank you. It kind of hits everyone. Similar, I think it's a hard day for our country, and it's good to honor everybody. And you know, personally, I was never in the military or anything, but I have a lot of friends and family that are. And I have a brother-in-law right now in the military, and it's good to look after them. You know, they're protecting us every day. It's just a day of remembrance, uh, a, a solemn day for sure, but a day to show the solidarity of our community and of our nation, and uh, really for the firefighters and the police officers in our community. Uh, again, a thank you to uh, the residents and the businesses that support us uh, day in and day out. Well, it's a special commemoration, 17 years since the tragic day that uh, we experienced in this country. And I think this is a wonderful gesture by uh, a neighbor of mine and a very generous citizen here to uh, salute the city employees, especially public safety, first responders. You know, it's, it's, a, it's a day that we all should remember. Um, and of the 3,000 or so people that unfortunately lost their lives, I think there were 400 public safety employees and it just goes to show you um, that what they do for us and, and that they put themselves at risk every day they, they don't know what's going to happen but they're they're there to serve us and, and to keep us safe I think the employees really look forward to it um, they're very thankful for it you can tell by the the smiling faces and how many of them are here it's 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 rare that we all get together in one place at one time and it's really good to see it's a wonderful opportunity to connect with a local resident and business owner and also to have citywide employees gather together and come out and play and be amongst each other so it's wonderful. You know it's just I've always been taught to leave it better than you found it and this is a better way of leaving it and for the employees to appreciate it and for me to thank them and I think it to be honest with you for the community to thank them. Thank you.